what's up everybody how are you doing welcome back to starfield and now we will be doing on the run and surgical strike well if these are both small quests i will make them part of the same video if it turns out to be long then well, i'll make both of these missions separate separate videos but let's go um, Last level here first. Welcome to the free. Star Collective, please maintain your current course while we scan your ship. And that's it. Enjoy. to help shoulder the load. Guys, this, this is an awesome weapon. 88 physical damage. 68 accuracy. This will be great. Once this has been modded. Yeah. And obviously this shotgun's incredible. Ah, this melee weapon is also okay, I guess. I don't do melee much, but that's that's the main thing. And I need to actually see. What's available? Sam close outfit is there. And this cap. What is Andrea keeping? This is what she's using right now, I guess. Is completely loaded. Five thirty one rounds, really. Anyway, ah, uh, good for her. I want her to perform good in combat. Just a second. Next map. Yeah. 
Yes, uh, I'm back. I was actually answering the door. Let's continue. Here's a nice little path. Red mile security. Yeah, I feel like I've seen her before. Uh, let's change into our business attire. I'm really not in the mood. Wait a minute. Judging by the wide-eyed and clueless look on your face, I'm guessing you're the new deputy. We'll find out, won't we? Well, your timing couldn't be worse. I've spent weeks trying to crack this smuggling ring and I'm about to take a very important meeting. At least you've got a little backbone. I don't have time to catch you up, so you're gonna have to follow my lead. I'm about to meet with a contact who might be able to give me vital information about the smuggling ring. If you play your cards right and don't do anything stupid, she might be able to help you find Marco. If you're ready, my contact is here and waiting. Follow me. That might be Donovan Reese. Yeah. I just like him intensely. Take a seat. How are you? With Autumn, huh? Who are you? A woman who's growing increasingly impatient, that's who. The deputy here is interested in meeting Marco to talk about that mercenary company he's been funding. Since part of that money is coming from his smuggling operation, we're working together. So you're investigating the first? Why? Mm, seems like a strange thing for a mercenary company to be doing. I guess an introduction is in order. Like Marco, Jade here is the head of a small smuggling cartel. Difference is her crew stays out of Freestar Collective space, while Marco's group operates exclusively within it. Except now he's looking to expand his operation, and he started moving in on my territory. If you think this gives you some kind of leverage, you're wrong. Sure, he might slow me down for a while, but a little competition won't break me. Because it might get a little awkward if my sister here had to... Well, thanks for the economics lesson, but I think I know my trade. Look, the bad news is, Marco's incredibly paranoid. He never stays in one place for long. The good news is... I know how to find him. But you're not gonna tell us yet because you want something. I want the same thing you do. I want Marco out of the picture. But like I said, getting a meeting with him can be damn near impossible. 
One of the few people who can arrange such a meeting is right here at Red Mile. May Divine. We've suspected for some time that Red Mile was a meeting place for smugglers. If she's in business with Marco, she won't give him up easily. Yeah, well, so can she. I can tell you right now what she's gonna want, because it's the same thing she always wants. She wants runners. It's how she makes most of her money. Of course, people that hard-blooded aren't easy to find. Yeah, well, I'm not going out on the mile. That's a death sentence. There has to be another way. You've been a ranger long enough that too many people know your face and your name. Runners attract a lot of attention. If someone recognizes you and tips off May, this whole thing is shot. You, on the other hand, are just a deputy. It's pretty unlikely that a lot of people know you. You don't have to do this. We'll find another way to get to Marco. Someone who volunteers to run the Red Mile, a deadly stretch of terrain just outside the cantina. It's infested with hostile creatures and few people survive. The ones that do... We, we are going to do this, obviously. Uh... I hope that's not false bravado, deputy, because this is life and death we're talking about. You have played your hand well, Jade. Using the rangers to eliminate a rival. Very clever. From where I'm sitting, we're using each other. If it's really as simple as asking May Divine for a meeting with Marco, then I guess that's all you need to do. We'll wait here for you. Try not to die, will you? You're really going yeah, to take on the we, we don't die. We don't die. We... Okay, so May Divine. This is for Maya Cruz. Um, do this. to challenge the Red Mile, or simply one seeking a respite from the burdens of life. My name is May, and I'm the proprietor of this establishment, home of the famous Red Mile. I assume you're familiar. Well, of course you are. How could you miss hearing about the Settled System's most exciting sporting event? Why even people from the most backwoods systems like Seoul have heard of the Red Mile? <clears throat> I'm happy to answer any other questions you might have. In the meantime, please enjoy our world's famous hospitality. That is true. But Mr. Graziani values his privacy. What is your business with him, exactly? It's quite a leap of faith that you're asking me to take. I have no particular love for Marco, but he is a business associate. So I must protect my reputation. Fortunately for you, I'm in a generous mood. It's been too long since we've had proper entertainment. If you're willing to provide it, I'll give you Marco. Are you prepared to run the Red Mile? I give you my word, which is something I never do lightly. Once you've begun, I'll collect bets from our patrons who will place wagers on your survival. That's what every runner says. Now that we're clear on what's expected of you, are you ready to begin? Good. Come with me and I'll introduce you. Thing we need to prepare is create a safe game. 
so that we can reload it and try again in case things get out of hand I highly doubt it actually survive don't worry about us let's see you must wear a space suit so let's do that first uh, yes and let's head outside I thought they would give us some weapons here to do the run. Um, okay, actually this is just the elevator. You should get some ammo stock, right? To uh, to load up in a backpack. Are we getting Andrea? Wow. So Andrea will complete the run with us. Isn't that going to give us an extra advantage? Dead meat. Dead meat. Best not to leave anything useful behind. Come on, come outside. We are waiting for you. Uh huh. I think we could just easily take a shortcut path, honestly. Fame and fortune await in the Red Mile. If you have what it takes. Congratulations, runner. You have succeeded where most have failed. In fact, you seem none the worse for wear. I'm not easily impressed, but you've managed to surprise me. As promised, I'll set up your meeting with Marco. Okay guys, so now that we have seen that it's possible to easily rush through this red mile, uh, we will actually do this the normal way. Which probably involves uh, fighting a lot of the monsters that will be on the way instead of simply skipping them. Um, if there was a miner here, but we will also keep an eye out for loot. Um, I'm guessing an area like this, based on my intuition, based on the thousands of hours I've put into video games. An area like this should have some decent loot. So let's go. Let's get this party started. Oh, nothing here. They got a scanner. And there's only the helium 3. something over here maybe only credits okay time for you to die you, what were you thinking but these creatures they don't think much all they th see is food and they try to eat us they don't realize that we have guns I 
reminds me of some kind of Pokemon. I don't know. Not really sure, but. some space, some breathing room. We're out of weapons. Yeah. So let's heal. Reload and where are you? Andrea is killing a lot of them actually. finally here let's take out our scanner should be some decent loot here Um, this is getting boring actually because they don't pose us any challenge none at all so let's get the loot and get the hell out of here get the backpack oh yeah this is nice ballistic weapons permanently do 5% more critical damage pretty useful actually packing some knowledge they are this is also interesting. Not much here. Med packs. This should be more med pack here. Amp amp is always good actually. A lot of amplifies your abilities, right? Makes you faster. And now it's time to just get the hell out of here. Okay, time to heal. We have a lot of med packs, so... Recovery. loaded now Dislocated limb became worse. Come on. You can't keep doing this to me. Let's heal a little bit.
this should be fun. Congratulations, Runner. You have succeeded where most have failed. In fact, you seem none the worse for wear. I'm not easily impressed. But you've managed to surprise me. As promised, I'll set up your meeting with Marco. I'll dispatch a courier to let him know you're coming. Please take a moment to relax and enjoy our hospitality. I'll return shortly. You're back. Are you okay? And here I was feeling like a nervous wreck the whole time. <laughs> Guess I had nothing to worry about. Anyway, I'm relieved you made it through okay. Why? Afraid you'd lose all that work you put into your smuggling investigation? I wouldn't expect you to understand. All you see in people is what you can get from them. I'm glad, because that was an incredibly brave thing you did. And we need rangers with that kind of courage. Also, I... I owe you an apology. I was pretty awful to you at first. I'm sorry about that. No, it's not that. I had a... A bad experience with another deputy that I was training. I'll tell you all about it after this is over. Okay? So you need to stay alive or you'll never hear the story. You're right. Let's focus on the job. Once you're on your way, I'll return to the rock and let the marshal know what's going on. Come home safe, deputy. That's an order. You always were the soft one, little sister. Oh, go to hell. Or at least make yourself useful and get us some drinks. Time for me to keep my promise, Runner? You can find Marco on Kodos aboard his ship. I'd advise you not to keep him waiting. He is not exactly patient. Then it's in all our interests that you make haste. Travel safely, Runner. Should you ever crave the challenge of the mile again, it will be here, waiting for you. Save the game. It's always nice to have a save game for doing something incredible. We could make a wrong choice, right? You the runner? Boss is in the back. Anyone who allows us just to walk into a space like this is very, very confident. Or, I suppose, very insecure. Are we in? Changed our clothes to something more. Rest clearly. That is the yeah. goal. Ho 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 ho! Never mind. I am not. I was, I was seeing the backpack there, but it's okay. Welcome. May's message didn't exactly make it clear why you wanted to meet with me. If you're looking for work, my organization is always in need of pilots and security personnel willing to take risks. Is that so? 
You did well to find me. I'm not an easy man to locate. Though I suppose we haven't exactly been keeping a low profile lately. Given the nature of the contract, the degree of exposure was always a risk, but a calculated one. To be honest, I think the Major is all but spoiling for a confrontation with the Rangers. Still, I confess, I'm a little disappointed that the Marshal sent a deputy instead of a full-fledged Ranger. <laughs> Tread carefully, Marco. You underestimate the deputy at your peril. And who might you be? Call me Andreja. Welcome to my home, Andreja. If I may be so bold, you possess a certain mystique. It's a pleasure to have you here. The feeling is not mutual, and I am not the one with whom you should be trying to curry favor, Marco. Your deputy friend here could have a bright future, assuming we all keep our heads. Attack me, and <laughs> you'll never get off this ship alive. I have a better idea. I'll give you what you want. If you agree to do the same for me, I won't tell you everything. I do still have some loyalty to my unit. However, I can point you in the right direction. In exchange, I want the Rangers to let me operate with a free hand. This is... This is it. This is it. They're just giving me the choice attack him absolutely perfect this is what i wanted i i, I don't know i just wanted to fight him the way he's talking is just so smug just so smug right these are exactly the kind of choices i made in with ryujin industries and i got two good fights it's time for him to die suit yourself to go and give her the slate they will not mess with the deputy or the rangers next time i find the interior of this ship comforting
Helga says I spend too much time at my terminal. He's probably right. Hey there, deputy. The way I hear it, you've been keeping busy jumping from one side of the Freestar Collective to the other. How do you like the job so far? Well, with an attitude like that, I sure wouldn't want to be one of them. So, what brings you by? Well, well, what do we have here? Well, this is new. Hmm. Very interesting indeed. I'll see what I can do. If you can get me another one of these, it'll give me more context for the encryption and should speed things up. In the meantime, you be careful out there, deputy. From what I've heard, these mercs mean business. And with that, the quest has come to an end. This one was longer and better, so I liked it. And we did some little, little, a little bit of exploration on the maps. Got some wild encounters with dinosaurs and dinosaurs-like monsters. All in all, it was interesting. So I'll end the video here and we'll do the surgical strike.